Hey guys, how's it going? The Human Atlas here, back again today with another episode of our FAU Dynasty and College Football Revamped. Today, we take on Rice in the battle between the Owls. Oh, wide open. Wester, touchdown, FAU. Oh, great throw. Alexander, 12 yards for the first down. Let's throw a screen. I'm feeling different. Hopefully, they're not in man. Ah, oh, there's no room there. That number one has been a absolute pain for me. I think we have a lot of different options on this play. And we weren't able to get it through there. We'll take the field goal here, I think. Oh my god. They almost blocked that again. I don't know what is happening. And number 62 just gets wrecked. Wasn't the most convincing field goal, but it worked. Third and 16. This is the type of field position I like. We're just staying back. Okay. Fourth and six. We'll take that throw every day of the week. I'm so happy that we're able to run in this game. I mean, maybe not run well, but run a lot better comparative to our previous game against Middle Tennessee. Wide open. Get up there, Alexander. Nice. Ten yards. We might look for uh, whoever's our halfback out of the backfield again. Oh, and that worked. Touchdown, Charles. I was <laughs> debating whether I run it myself. But I'm like, no, let's give it to a guy who's quick in our return, man. Do we bring Helm? No, I, I think we keep Helm back. Oh, and that's an easy pick. Oh, come on, block for me, bro. And yet another mess up. I did not turn on game audio until, uh, until just now. Oh, basically a QB draw. Tronti, nine-yard touchdown run. Untouched. There, that incompletion stops the clock, which is really useful. That's annoying. I was hoping he'd be able to stop and turn up field there. But, field goal, come on. Get in! Oh! And Pause. Did this man just say that game was tighter than spandex on a sumo? Okay, look, I know Texas A&M beat Arkansas 41-38. But... Ugh. That was pain. That was pain. He turned. Chase gets a first down very easily. What is, who's saying that? I can't, it's like indiscernible. Watch the run. Alexander wide open, touchdown. In this battle between the Owls, we're, we have a bit of black Air Force energy. Let's get a stop right now. 
Oh no. Oh yes. Okay, we somehow got a tackle there. Fourth and inches. It's fourth and two. What? They're going for it. But the defense topped them both by coming up with a stop. We're bringing Young. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, nice fourth down. Charles cuts the outside. Oh, that was a great rush right there. Brad, you just don't see this very often anymore in college football. That is their fifth first down on this drive alone. They have great rhythm right now as an offense, and look at that poor defense. They're looking Sprained over ankle, yeah, he's out for the rest of the game. Help. They need to change things up. Here's the 12th play of the drive. Charles right down the middle, almost got it. And the goal line defense digging in here. Charles touchdown. Oh. He gets out to about the 25 yard line. That's annoying. I thought we were going to get him with the hit stick, but 13 rushes for 4 yards. Wow. Man, our rushing average just went way the heck down because of those two runs. Oh, he's got room. Ah. Fourth and two. We're going for it. Yes, is this not the best? Not the best idea when we're up so much. Irvin wide open, first and goal. It's not the most sportsmanlike thing we're doing, but got to keep the offense good for you guys. Got to get some highlights. Oh, great. Great tackle there. Or great broken tackle by Charles. And we get a touchdown. Five yards right down the middle. Oh, come on, running back. We have such good field position, too. Let's go for it. Why not? Why not? Going to right RB here is who I'm going to throw it to. And he got it. Bro broke the tackle. He broke another tackle and he's in. <laughs> what a play by Willie Wright. Oh, we're getting this. Oh my god. That's tough. And a sack. Fourth and 15. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find and they're going for it. Wow. I mean, of course they're going to because of the, what the score is, but. They cannot get it. Can we get the snap off? Because why not? Now we, never mind. Great game there. Cannot complain with a shutout. And, yeah, 55-0 in the Battle of the Owls. Great performance. Was it flawless? No. But, I mean, why would I have any issues with how the game turned out? Well, a little bit of a preview for next week's game. A ranked opponent against UAB. That is going to be a really good game. Um, and we've moved up to number 14. Let's take a little bit of a stroll over to top stories. Let's see. Oklahoma takes down Notre Dame. And uh, SMU beats TCU. Yikes. Any other? I told you LSU was going to beat Georgia, and they did. And Ohio State beats Wisconsin. And Oregon beats Cal. 
Let's uh, take a quick look at the top 25 pulls, see if there's any other movement. No, it only looks like it was... Oh, that was a close game. Movement due to Notre Dame losing. Yep. Did we leapfrog someone? Who dropped? Number 15? Oh, TCU lost SMU. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do it. Number nine. Others receiving votes. Dropped out Georgia. And you, okay, there we go. But we're now number 14 in the country, playing number 17, which will give us a little bit more clout. Minnesota eked it out against Iowa, and Oregon eked it out against Cal. Hopefully that's not a... Um, sign of what's going to happen tomorrow in the game against Cal. And it all and and as always we'll give a quick look to the Heisman watch. It is completely different this week. We have we still have Master Teague, he's moved up into first, and we still have Ty Chandler who's moved up. But other than that, we have Jarrett Patterson from Buffalo. Last week, he had a very good game as a running back. Kellen Mond, QB from Texas A&M, had a really good game against Arkansas. And Travis Etienne's still here, but he drops uh, maybe one or two places. One or two places. That wraps up today's episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new around here, please subscribe and drop a follow on my Twitch, which is linked in the description down below. There's also a link to join my Discord, should you want to. Um, more college football content will be coming out soon. Um, I'm going to be on vacation this weekend. I might get another episode recorded tonight, but we do have a stream happening in an hour or so from when I'm recording this. So I guess it wouldn't really matter because this video is not going to come out right now. But yeah, if you want to see me stream, yeah, links for my Twitch is in the description. Thank you guys so much. It's been your brother, the Human Atlas. Take care, y'all. Have a great weekend and see ya.